just outside South Bend at Mishawaka, Indiana. Jeff Pond, the one of the umpires with Anthony Eats. Doug Shouse, the referee, by 15 points. And Ed Conroy's return to Charleston. They're headed to their holiday break after the game tonight. There's a drive and score for Tay Davis to get Notre Dame on the board. This is Winston Hill, another grad transfer. Ed Conroy starts three of them in this lineup. And on call, there's Delora Brown to put the Bulldogs on the board. And without those two guys, Notre Dame becomes very, very thin. And a ball away basket for A.J. Smith. Back-to-back -back turnovers by the Irish. Here's White, or Smith rather, on the drive, and he will feed Melora Brown. Is one thing, but Ed Conroy kind of started the whole process for Elijah Morgan's post-prep basketball career. There's a block by Melora Brown. You can see he's got more tape on that left shoulder. We'll see if he's able to come back. Three ball, Penesny good. Laura Brown for the call, working on Kevin Jai. Burton trying to help. They feed the lane. That got blocked. On the drive and shot by Durr. Here early. Durr on the inbounds. Morgan to three. Good. Right in front of the Notre Dame bench. In traffic here, Zona can't finish. They battle inside. Matt will run it down in the corner. Burton a standing three. Got it. And that's a funny looking little shot, but watching him on tape, when he gets that much time and room, he's not bad from out there. On the drive, Madison Durr. Burton. On the attack, tried to bounce it down to Zona, taking away Melora Brown. Another Notre Dame turnover be their fourth. Melora Brown cutting through scores. He's got a half dozen. Straight to the goal. Here's Burton. Pondesny a hanger in the lane. And the rebound pulled away. For Smith. Backdoor cut and blocked out of there. Pondesny on the layup attempt of Cam Roberts. Quickly inside the catch and score for Kevin Jai. That's what Notre Dame wants to get. They want to force the Citadel into contested two-point shots. Two for three. Hitting just five field goals in 18 tries. And they've made this 7-0 run while the Citadel hits their first field goal in their last five on the dunk by Melora Brown. Five straight from Melora Brown has pushed the Bulldogs back in front. Dan, here's the first of the five. A.J. Smith, who is completely recovered from a little shoulder bump in the opening couple of minutes of our ball game tonight. Melora Brown with three to shoot, a triple away, and good. I'm not sure the schoolyard approach was the exact science that went into play here. <laughs> well, Wes, when the clock runs that long, I'm not sure there is an exact sign. No, I think you're right. Here's a driving score by Madison Durr. Oh, a crafty sophomore guard who was all freshman a year ago in the Southern Conference. Average seven points, three rebounds, two assists, play the ball. And there's Konezny again. He's come back with a little bit of vengeance. And a tiny the interesting thing about, about Konezny, Wes, he drives. Roberts trying to get baseline. Nicely done by Shrewsbury. Four to shoot. Elijah Morgan launches. Oh. It is. Because of his friendship with Ed Conroy's sons. But here tonight. Lead is four for the Bulldogs. Scoop and score, Kadesny. And the rebound for Burke. Relatively quiet first half scoring wise for Marcus Burton, who will go to the basket and score. Get the rebound and get down the court. It's a good transition opportunity, and Burton takes it all the way to the basket. Morgan backs out into the corner. He'll fire again and hit. Notre Dame has struggled to score, West, but they've done a nice job keeping the Citadel out of the lane on defense. Konezny tried to slip baseline. Fall away is good. And now with 3.08 to play, here is Durr. Trying to sneak into traffic. That ball got deflected, I think, from Davis. 
Jai is also in traffic. Now turned over, and here's Konezny down the lane. Scores and draws the foul. J.R. Konezny's got it. Really lifting Notre Dame. Unlike a place like VMI, who just has undergraduates, they have graduate programs. Here is uh, the drive and score. He's a 6'3 freshman from Lake Mills, Wisconsin. And I think this is, uh, there's a three ball from Durr. Ed Conroy knows he's got some Midwest guys on his roster. Here's a drive and score by Marcus Burton, who's now got seven in the first half. Kicked out by Roberts and turned over. Here is Burton at full tilt. And the tap follow is good. Konezny. Inside Konezny. Now back to Jai on the post. Over the wall. Brown and rolls in for Kevin Jai and the Irish in front. Entry pass from Durr to Malora Brown. And now turned over by the Bulldogs. Shrewsbury ahead for Burton and the layup good. Into the corner, here's Morgan. He'll get a screen for a three, and now Elijah Morgan knocks another one down. It's sort of been a theme for each team, Wes. They seem to get rolling a little bit, then they turn it over. And here is a breakaway on a steal by Elijah Morgan. And another offensive rebound. That's, I think, you know, turnover's probably going to be charged to Morgan, but Kinesny... This is Robert or Mar Marcus Pegram has come on the floor wearing zero for the Bulldogs. Tough shot in traffic, and that's A.J. Smith. Largest lead of the night now for the Bulldogs on the second field goal of the night for the sophomore from Charlotte. And we've said a couple times, Smith is a big, strong guard. Those are the kind of shots he can make. He has used his quickness and his size to really good effect this evening. On the drive, Smith and a bucket. Eight point game. Madison Durr trying to find some space. I think Davis got a piece of that and finally collects the miss. And Roberts trying to get things square. Pegram rather trying to get things square offensively. Pegram baseline back out front. Here is Morgan. Step back three off the window for Elijah Morgan. Wow. Well, Elijah Morgan's caught fire tonight. He continues to. For these Irish. Melora Brown working on Zona. Davis on the drive, blocked by Zona. Out of there, Shrewsbury and Notre Dame in transition. And Burma had to finish the layup. Other way comes Smith, and A.J. Smith gets the and one. There, Notre Dame misses one they should have had. And then Smith, we talked about his strength as a guard. He takes the contact. His average in just six of his last 15 from the floor. He's only taken three shots tonight. Shrewsbury, a deep three. And looked like Booth couldn't quite flag it down. And on the drive, a euro and a bucket for A.J. Smith. And the Bulldogs get in an overdrive. First, a terrific coast-to-coast -coast move for Smith. 11 now in the ball game, nine in this second half. And here are the Bulldogs again in transition. And this is the layup for Madison Durham. And then a moment ago, here is Madison Durr at the rim. Meanwhile, Micah Shrewsbury has gone and gotten Raheem Brayton a uh, walk on. And there is Kerry Booth with a nice turn and score at the high post. Irish are just three of their last 17 from three. Three of 17 tonight in the ballgame. There's Melora Brown. The right hand move is good. And one and done is Notre Dame. And that's turned over by Citadel. Here's Burton, and one with the score. Burton, that's pretty impressive, but Kinesny knocks the ball away, and then Burton picks it up, and he's just flying to the basket. And now the Citadel, under three to go, going to burn some clock. 
Here's Smith skipping in. Nice cross court pass, and A.J. Smith had a. And Winston Hill, as we approach two minutes, shot clock down to five. Smith launches. Hill, the rebound on the backside, scores on the stick back. First field goal for Winston Hill. Good thing we're going to South Bend during the ACC travels to find out more about J.T. Kelly's business. But tonight is about Ed Conroy and the Citadel Bulldogs.